Hey guys, it's Danny, and today I have a nail polish haul for you guys. I haven't done one in a pretty long time, um, so I'm super excited to do one. I know it's been a while. Um, I decided, you know, I haven't really been doing my nails lately, um, but I want to get back into it. And honestly, I've been wanting to try this brand for a while, so I decided to, um, make a small order. Uh, I guess just real quick, like this is what I have on my nails right now. Like a shifty color. And uh, this is not any of the polishes that I have to show. Um, this is just called Green Iridescent. And I got it from Hot Topic. It's um, the brand Blackheart. It comes in a skull shaped bottle and it's only like five bucks. Um, and it's pretty good for, you know, it's actually, it's really good for $5. Um, you know, this has been on for about a week. There's some tip wear and like this one chipped, but other, you know, I mean, pretty good wear for as long as I've had it on. So anyway, the polish that I actually got is by Mooncat, juicymooncat.com. Um, and Mooncat used to be uh, used to go by the name I am um, Live Love Polish, um, and I wanted to try them when they were Live Love Polish, and then uh, and then I heard that they changed to Moon Cat. So, so the box actually comes like this, and opens like this, and then it has that with their social medias, and then it had the boxes like this, and then ah, uh, I wasn't expecting it to do that. And then this is just the boxes, obviously. I don't, the boxes, oh, okay. The boxes do have a sticker on the back that have the name on them. Um, I just wanted to show off all of the packaging. I like the purple and the green together, very nice. So that's just, like I said, just the boxes. And I bought four polishes, as you, as you can see from the fact there was four slots. And these, the nail polishes range between $13 and $16 a bottle. I think all of the ones that I bought were $14 each. Um, and she's got a bunch of different finishes and um, things like that. Um, her cream polishes are $13 and I think some of her top and base coats might be $13 as well but I know the, the cream polishes are $13 some of the shimmers and hollows and then like the shimmers the hollows the multi chrome stuff like that those are between third or I'm sorry between 14 and 15 and then her magnetic polishes are all $16 a piece um, she does have a loyalty program if you sign up you get points you get points for certain things and you also get points for um, purchases and then you can use the points I think it's five points for every dollar um, and then you use the points you can exchange the points for a free nail polish and there's I think um, I know she changes it every so often but there's like four or five ish polishes you can choose from um, and for between 600 and a thousand points. So anyway, I'm going to show you guys the four that I got. Starting with this one. It is so pretty. This one is called Mercury's Tears. I don't know if you can see that or not because it is kind of small. But as you can see, it is so pretty. Let me show you the side bottle. Oh my gosh, like look at that. Like that shimmer, the blue, and the duochrome. That's the swatch. This one is so pretty. I cannot wait. Like, it's just so many, so many good ones. Um, this one is called Fallen Angels. I'll show you the bottom, even though I don't think it's in focus because it is really small. And this polish is actually gray, like a gray purple, but with like that blue shift. Just look at it. It is so pretty. 
and then this one. This one is called Heart of Stone. And it's like a pink. I don't I don't really know what color it's supposed to be because they you know they mentioned it being like a stone color then but it's got like this pink shift in it. Like oh and it's got these nice glitters in it. It is just really pretty. Trying to show off all of it. And I don't think it's really justice. I don't think it's being done for really any of these polishes on the screen. They are so pretty in person. And the last one, which I don't know but might be my favorite, um, which is weird because I usually, I never really liked these ones before, but is this one. And it is called a super villain. Again, I'm showing you the bottom even though I'm sure it's not, but this is super villain. And it is so pretty because it is a duochrome from purple to blue with some hollow speckles in there, like those glitter part particles or like nice little hollow glitters. But this is a flaky, um, I think you can, you can tell, I think from the swatch, like it is super, hold on, let me see if I turn off this light, that's right here, if maybe you can see, uh, okay, let's see if you can see the flakes in the swatch a little bit better, maybe, so that's, there's flakies in it, that's two coats. But this is the kind of polish that would be really pretty just putting like one coat over like bare nails or like a nice like um, very neutral or a color that kind of matches your your skin tone. Like for me it would be like a kind of a milky whitish pink color. Um, if I put that on my nails and then put one coat of this over top, like if I didn't want to do straight naked nails would look really great or you can really build it up with an extra coat or if you want super full coverage um, you can use a makeup sponge like you do like your first like coat or two and then you take a makeup sponge put a little bit on the makeup sponge and dab it and that'll give you really full full coverage glitters or flakies um, this I think would also look good over black but I just think it's so pretty like on its own and again, here is like the back. You can see, you can actually see the glitters a little bit better. I'm gonna go through again with this light off and show you guys the other ones to see if maybe you can see, yeah, like you can kind of see the glitters I was trying to show you guys in this one. You can definitely see them a little bit better with this light off. So again, this one's hard as stone. This one is Fallen Angels. And then this one is Mercury's Tears. This one also has a slight like hollow glitter in it. So these are the four moon cap polishes, like I said, that I got. I am planning on getting more. Um, I I could not decide. I had such a hard time trying to figure out which ones to buy. Like, I had asked uh, my hubby if it was cool, you know, because I wanted to check, make sure, you know, that everything else had been, like, you know, taken care of. And he was like, oh, yeah, you know, go for it. I was like, all right. He goes, well, how much, you know, just out of curiosity, you know, how much you look into to, you know, get. And I was like, oh, God, I was like, I have no idea. I was like, I really I'm going to need you to give me a number <laughs> because I want to buy them all, you know. So I just basically gave him the most expensive price per bottle um, because, like I said, they start at 13 and then 16 is the more expensive ones but I wasn't sure what like finish or price like you know what I mean which ones I was gonna get so I just told him they were $16 a bottle 
so that way if I did decide I wanted you know you know what I mean so he was like okay he's like you can get four bottles and I was like all right cool and uh it did end up being a little bit cheaper like I said because I uh, did get um all four of these were only $14 so it was a little bit cheaper so that was nice but you know and for this website if you spend I want to say it's $49 you get free shipping so that was nice oh goodness hmm, shoot <laughs> so yeah so all I've done is swatch them they swatched beautifully on the swatch sticks but I cannot wait to use these I don't know which one I'm gonna use first might actually be this blue one because it's super pretty and kind of in a mood for that or it could even be heart of stone or if I can't decide I'll probably I might just use a different polish altogether who knows but I can't wait I'm already um thinking about what which ones I want to get next because they are also all so beautiful and I mean I don't know if I'm gonna try any of her creams um, just because I don't, um, I don't own a lot of creams, which kind of like makes me want to try her creams. But also I know that like Wet n Wild and Sally Hansen, I mean Sally Hansen is, is a little bit more expensive than, you know, like Wet n Wild, which is like $2, $3 maybe. I don't know. I haven't bought it in a long time, but, um. You know, I know I can get good, cheap creams from, like, Walmart for a couple bucks. So I don't know if I'll ever get any of her creams. Um, but then again, though, she, um, you know, you never know. Maybe I will. Now, if you go to the website, um, there's a whole bunch, like, all the individual polishes. And then she has sets like a lot of places do like she'll have um certain um like collections she'll have like where you can just buy the whole collection like she's got a i think it's called the fairy tale collection that one is really pretty um and usually these sets are at a discount when you buy like the whole collection or the whole set it's usually a discount um she has a starter set that looked really nice that I think was like six bottles and that one came with a whole bunch of different of her finishes she, uh, she used mattes um, had one of her magnetic polishes in there um, you know what I mean so it had a bunch of different finishes in the sets um, she's got um, two that I'm interested in getting and one is like the purple set and one is the blue set and they're just it's five polishes and they're all purple or they're all blue so you know um, if you're having a hard time deciding sometimes the sets are the way to go plus they're like I said you can get a little bit more a little bit cheaper so that's always nice um, she does have like base coats and top coats um, she has a matte top coat. She has like a nail elixir, which I'm assuming is an oil. Um, just like a nail oil. Um, she's got a bunch of that kind of stuff. She's got tools in there. She does sell the magnetic wands for the magnetic polishes. But it also does say as like, I guess a, like a just so you know, like disclaimer type of situation. So you don't buy another magnet. That if you buy a one of the sets that has a magnetic polish or if you buy or if, if your order has a magnetic polish in it period you get a free magnetic um little wand so that's cool um yeah the company is great i love the nail polishes so far i can't wait to actually use them on my nails and reading about it the owner is really cool like she is an immigrant to the U.S. She started her business here. 
you know, she's just, she seems really great. Um, and I think it's 10% of each purchase goes to help find animals um, for our homes. So that's really cool. And I really, really like that part a lot as well. So yeah, if you love nail polish and you want to check them out, you really should. Like I said, it is a moon cat. Oh, and just so you know, each bottle is 12, 12 mils or um, 0 0.4 fluid ounce. So a decent sized bottle. Okay, so that is my video. Sorry, I got a little rambly and weird. Um, but I haven't filmed in a while, so I'm kind of like, uh. But alright, um, I'll let everyone go, and I will talk to you later. Bye!